Fact of the day. Fact of the day. Hello, hi, and welcome to Fact of the Day with me, Mark Lossie. Today, we're talking about The Mathematics of Love, which is a book by a lady called Hannah Fry. Did you know that a third to a half of all marriages end in divorce? So this was studied by a group of psychologists and subsequently mathematicians. They videotaped couples talking about contentious issues. This is over a period of years. They videotaped them talking about contentious issues and they recorded their breathing rate, their heart rate, their heart rate, how much they sweated, and also any facial expressions. And they put all this data into these mathematical equations and they gave them positive and negative values. As a, as a side point, did you know that um, couples who argue and go into a spiral of arguing mathematically are identical to countries that are on, on the brink of a nuclear war. Mathematically they're identical. And they plugged it into these equations and one of the equations is called the wife equation. It is called the wife equation. The wife equation is the wife's reaction which is equal to the wife's mood when she's alone plus the wife's mood when she's with her husband plus how she reacts to the last thing that her husband said to her. So they plugged all these into, they plugged all this information into this, these calculations, into these equations, and they said with a 90% accuracy, they can tell whether or not a couple are going to get divorced. 90% accuracy. So just by taking some readings and then plugging into these equations, they can tell whether or not you're going to divorce your partner. That's amazing. There's also this thing called the negativity threshold, and the negativity threshold is basically how annoying your partner has to be before you get angry. And you think that the successful couples would have a high negativity threshold, as in, they let the small things go, they don't let them bother them, and it's only when it gets to the really big things that they feel like they need to talk about it. That's wrong, completely wrong. In fact, it's the exact opposite. The ones that are successful are ones that have a low negativity threshold. These ones that have a positive outlook on the relationship, these ones that, that don't let small trivial things go, go to the side, these are ones that give each other time to to vent their frustrations. These are the ones that don't let things build up. And mathematically, mathematically it's been proven that it's better to not let the sun go down on an argument. So there you have it, that's the mathematics of it. That's why two plus two can equal divorce. Kind of, maybe not 100%, but you know the maths behind it. If you enjoyed this, please hit like, please hit subscribe. Thanks so much for watching, really appreciate your time. Love you, bye, love you, bye, love you, bye. Classic.